Let us go through the main points of the lesson. Resources. Anything that has some utility to satisfy our needs is known as resource. For example, air, water, food, metals. Let us look at this picture. It shows a chair, a book, a car. जो भी चीज हम डे टू डे लाइफ में यूज करते हैं उसको रिसोर्स कहते हैं बुक कार चेयर आर द एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ रिसोर्सेस रिसोर्सेस कैन बी क्लासिफाइड इनटू थ्री टाइप्स नेचुरल रिसोर्सेस ह्यूमन मेड रिसोर्सेस एंड ह्यूमन रिसोर्सेस नेचुरल रिसोर्सेस आर द रिसोर्सेस व्हिच ह्यूमन बीइंग्स get from the nature and are used without any changes for example water forest etc natural resources are of two types renewable resources and non renewable resources renewable resources are the resources which can be renewed or replenished Renewable resources are also called inexhaustible resources. For example, sunlight, wind, air. Non-renewable resources are the resources which have a limited stock and cannot be renewed or may take thousands of years to renew. For example, minerals and fossil fuels. when the natural resources are changed by human beings to make them useful then they are called human made resources for example bridges roads technology ye sari cheeze human beings ne banayi hain isliye inko human made resources kehte hain human beings are also a resource Human beings along with knowledge skill and technology can make the best use of natural resources so human beings are called human resources for example teachers managers engineers soldiers etc conservation of resources means using the available resources carefully and giving them time to get renewed we know that most of the resources are limited and exhaustible agar hum resources carefully use nahi karenge to wo ek din khatm ho jayenge aur hamari aage ki generation unko use nahi kar payegi so using resources wisely is called conservation of resources